Hello Super User! Today we're going to learn how to align and move dynamics quickly and easily in Finale. Uh, now to do this we're actually going to use a couple things. One is a TG Tools plugin called Align and Move Dynamics. The second is actually going to be Keyboard Maestro. And so Keyboard Maestro is an app you can download. And if you want to figure out how you can start using this with Finale, see my video, uh, which I'll link in the description of how to get started with Keyboard Maestro and Finale. But for now, know that we're actually going to set up a simple macro to do this for us. So if I head over to Keyboard Maestro, we're going to have a macro called Move Dynamics Down. Okay, Hockey, that's the hockey I've decided to do for this. Uh, that's just Control Shift S, right? And then it's going to run a script. Okay, so we're going to go to Plugins, TG Tools, Align, Move Dynamics, Insert Text, negative 0.5, and then press Go, and then Close. So this is what it will look like if you're actually doing it by hand. We're going to go to Plugins, TG Tools, Align and Move Dynamics. We're going to press negative 0.05, go, and then close. Which, as you can see, this aligns all the dynamics and moves them nicely and easily. So if we go back to the macro, we can see that that's basically what it's doing. It's just going Plugins, TG Tools, Align and Move Dynamics, negative 0.5, go, then close. So if you press the keyboard shortcut, we will see that it just automatically moves the dynamics down. And we can place them nicely wherever we want them to. And as we can see, um, I have a corollary thing called move dynamics up, which is the exact same thing, just slightly different keyboard shortcut that moves the dynamics up 0 0.05 instead of down. And so what this allows me to do is, uh, like let's say I have a part where the things are really low, I could just move the dynamics down and realize, oh, there's still collisions and then just move it down far enough such that there are no collisions. And so that is the quick and easy way to align and move dynamics in Finale using Keyboard Maestro.